the indicator on your instrument will appear red when your calibration is expired. In Color IQC or Color I Match, the status bar will also show the remaining time of your calibration. Calibration is initiated through your software. A different calibration mode will need to be created for each configuration you'll be using. This consists of a measurement mode, specular condition, UV filter position, port aperture and lens size, as well as a few additional settings. Each calibration mode can be named to allow you to easily identify it. Before calibrating your instrument, make sure your optics area, white calibration tile, and black trap are all free of dust or dirt, as that can dramatically affect your calibration. Refer to the video on cleaning your instrument to learn more. To calibrate your instrument in transmission measurement mode, you'll first need to locate the following items for your transmission kit. Select the mode you wish to calibrate and click the Calibrate button. The calibration can also be triggered by clicking this icon in your application toolbar. If you're using Reflection Total Transmission Mode, begin by performing a reflectance calibration. Otherwise, position the transmission white plaque on the sample holder so it's facing your aperture port. Follow the software prompt to take the white calibration. Next, open the transmission cover by lifting up on the locking pin while sliding the cover back. For total transmission measurements, place the transmission holder inside the transmission compartment so it faces towards the sphere. It should sit in two notches to help ensure the correct placement. Center the black plastic blocking panel on the transmission sample holder, take the reading through your software. For direct transmission measurements, simply rotate the sample transmission holder so it faces the lens side before taking your black measurement. Once calibration is complete, the calibration light will appear green. Remember that each configuration needs to be calibrated.